what we've done to begin this process of this uh, new ways of doing cinnamon rolls, the easy way, I've taken a pan and I've buttered it thoroughly. Then I placed some brown sugar on the bottom and then I sprinkled it with cinnamon. That way the bottom of the rolls will be caramelized. And then you can see that I spaced the cinnamon rolls so that they have plenty of room to rise. And then I put a little bit of heavy cream just on top. And now we're just gonna take the time to let them rise and we'll be back to show you what they look like and then we'll proceed from there. You could do this on Christmas morning, get up and mm. take them out, let them rise and do this and put them in a half hour, 20 minutes later. You've got, cause you know, these are best served hot. And I believe we get to eat one, don't we? We are, as soon as they yes. come out. Okay, but what temperature in the oven? 350 for, let's say about 20, 25 minutes. Keep an eye on them because every oven's different so that they brown. But you start making these, you'll be making them all the time. Your kids, your family. And you're going to look like a hero. Ooh, and you, like heroes, heroes, and maybe. if you like them this much, okay. you don't have to share them with the recipe with everybody. Sometimes we just keep recipes to ourselves. Yes. That's not being selfish. That's just being That's right. Very practical. Of, but, we're here, but here we are on YouTube sharing it with everybody. But that's oh, okay. because Now, you could tell your friends about this. You could subscribe to this. You could... Like, like, ring we, the bell. We need people to subscribe to our we do. blog. I know. <laughs> a lot of time. A lot of time. So we've come up with something that we think you're going to love. It's something that you can uh, have in a couple of hours in the morning if you get up. Get up. So what we we're going to explain it to you and show you, and it is okay. Delicious. People don't even know how easy but how delicious this is okay can you go through the recipe right quick just, just fast, well fast, fast. i will but i'd like to do it as i'm going okay then i have to type on there then if you know okay don't. but what I, we've showed you earlier how we prepared the pan the baking pan by putting butter in it and then we put a layer of brown sugar and some cinnamon mm -hmm. and as i said earlier that's going to caramelize the bottom so the, of the pan. So what we did here, and you can buy these at the grocery store, they're called Rhodes frozen cinnamon rolls. Okay. They're little ball, the little cinnamon rolls, and they're frozen. Mm. So what you want to do, do this the night before. Okay, I will. If you're going to do cinnamon rolls in the morning, will. she will. Uh, yeah. Mm -hmm. So we took the the, took the rolls and we uh, let them sit in the refrigerator all night, mm -hmm. va, so that that way they're ready. So then in the morning, when we take them out, because we want to proof these. Okay. Did you see me do them? Would you explain proofing? Proofing means letting them rise. Oh. You see here how they've doubled in size? It's ready. Okay. So this is where the fun begins and how easy it is. Mamie, take your hand and push down on each one of those. Use your bare hand. It won't hurt it. I have not touched the dog today. Now push yet. your hand down in there and indent that. A little more than that. We want to indent it. I want to? Yeah. Oh. A little more, even like this. You want a good indentation in there. Mm. Uh, on all I, of them? All of them, yeah. Well, this you, really messes up my hand. But you can wash them. Oh, okay. Okay? So you want to indent the cinnamon roll. Okay. I don't really care for this at all. Well, it's, it's part of the job. Oh. Then That's see how they're indented. Mm. Then the secret here is you're going to take heavy whipping cream uh -huh. and you're going to pour them in the dent, in the dent. And, and, and around it. Oh. And of course it's going to go on the bottom mm. too. But you're going to have, um, so you want to have, what the does, the cream just enhances the dough. So and this, they, this, obviously is not low fat. No, it's not. That's oh, why they're good. Good taste. You know, anything that tastes good is not low fat. low fat. I'm sorry to tell you that. So heavy cream in there. Then what I've done here, Mimi, mm -hmm. I have taken some brown sugar mm -hmm. and I melted some butter. Okay. And I put a little bit of cinnamon in there. 
and I've made like a little sauce here. See that? You know, my neighbor from Lebanon in Anthem said she put absolutely everything. She had cinnamon in everything. Sometimes it tastes weird and some things. Well, they're real big here. on those warm spices in is it? the Mideastern okay. country. Oh, uh, so okay. what we've done, we've got that. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to spread a little bit of cinnamon over the top mm -hmm. a little more because these are cinnamon rolls. Mm -hmm. So we're going to do that. Okay. Ooh, then that what good. we're going to do, Mamie, I want you to spread some of uh, these pecans over them. Wash your hands. Oh, can I? I yeah. Can. Oh. Yeah, you can. Now these pecans are very good. They come from, we talked about it before, Mamie's niece and nephews, they're home in Roswell, New Mexico, and they grow these and they yes. are outstanding. So I want you to spread them liberally on, the, on top of the rolls. Well, they missed the rolls, but. Okay. And now this is strictly optional, but they're sure good with the, mm -hmm. with the pecans on them. They are. So you see how this is building up? Mm -hmm. Okay, now what we're gonna do, Mamie, I want you to take this sauce that we made again with brown sugar, butter, and cinnamon. And what I do, I add a little pinch of salt. You always wanna have a little salt. You do? In your things like this, because it brings out the natural flavor. So you go ahead and spread that over. All of it? Mm -hmm. But we'll see how it goes. Okay. But spread it. Spread it over your rolls like that. Beautiful. And you see what we're doing? We're just, this is these are so outrageously delicious. But again, there's a lot on them, but you're gonna love the results and you're gonna love the time element. After I took them out of the refrigerator this morning, I let them raise for about an hour and a half to get they get a nice raise on them. That should be a good one. Little tad more there. Okay, now. We've okay. got that. So we're ready um, to put these in the oven. Oh, that quick. That quick. I They're, love it. And, it, and these are going to be so delicious hot. And then while we're here, I'll go over this too. Okay. We're going to, I made a, you got to have a cream cheese icing with cinnamon rolls. Yeah. So works. let your cream cheese come to room temperature. Mm -hmm. I added a little bit of butter some powdered Ooh. sugar, and um, heavy cream. Mm. Again, heavy cream. But this isn't, a, I didn't put a lot of powdered sugar in this oh. because this is so, so sweet. sweet. Yeah. But I still wanted to have an icing on it. So mm. adjust mm. it according to what flavor you like as you're adding. So okay. this is all ready to go. You're just going to take your, you don't want to over... Yeah, you could make this sweeter if you wanted to, but I have enough sugar in here to last till Jesus comes. So I don't want to overdo it, but I but you still want a little bit of sin of, of your icing. So this is all going in there. Now, normally we wouldn't eat these now, but I want to show you what they look like. So I'm going to get a spatula out here, and I've got a trusty plate, and I'm going to pull one of these out. And this is pure decadence. There it is. There's your cinnamon roll. And if you wanted to, you could mm, take some more of the sauce drizzle. on the bottom, mm -hmm. like that. You can do anything you want. It belongs to you. but. There they are. That is our cinnamon rolls, deluxe. Now we're gonna show you what they taste like. Okay. I want you to try this, it's so gooey, which you want cinnamon rolls to be gooey, and then it's gonna be, they're so light. I, I mean, they're so hot. I am going to put this in some gooey before I eat and not burn my mouth. You can take hotter than I can in my mouth, that's for sure. Mm. It is absolutely decadent. Mm. Mm. You and will want some. With the heavy cream in there, I mean, these are so light. They're lighter than a croissant. 
if you can believe that. Mm -hmm. So, we wanted you to see how easy and but yet how delicious. It's, and if you don't want to have all the caramel on the bottom, you don't have to. I just add that because I like it. But this is a perfect meal for a holiday, for a breakfast, if you wanted to take it somewhere. Go Trump!